going to go over how to focus a microscope. First, it's important to familiarize yourself with the pieces of a microscope, which were earlier reviewed in another video. However, it is really important that you know the coarse focus and fine focus. With the 4x and the 10x objective lenses, we use the coarse focus. With the 40x and 100x, we'll use the fine focus. Once you have your slide in place, your light adjusted, and your ocular lens is adjusted, we can start with the 4x lens, and we can look in the microscope and use the coarse adjustment knob and just keep twisting it until you see your object. You can bring it somewhat into focus and then use the mechanical stage adjuster to find the main object that you're looking for. Once you have that in place, we can move to the 10x lens. Now you can still use the coarse adjustment knob but oftentimes the fine adjustment knob will do. Once you have your object in place, we can switch over to the 40x objective lens and only use the fine adjustment. Usually only small adjustments work with the fine adjustment knob. Adjust until you see your object now we're going to show you a view inside of the microscope. Right now we're on the 4x objective lens. You should also note that sometimes the 4x lens is just enough magnification to view your specimen or whatever you're looking at. Every time you exchange objective lenses, let's say from the 4x to the 10x to the 40x, the field of view is decreasing. So sometimes it's not beneficial to exchange objective lenses, whereas the 4x lens or 10x lens will be enough power. Remember to use the coarse adjustment knob and as you twist it you'll see the stage rising and don't be afraid to really twist it. Now you can start to go slower that you start seeing your specimen in the field of view and right there it looks pretty focused. You can move around with the stage. Adjustment. For this specific specimen we want to get a closer look so right now we're in focus with the 4x lens. You can go ahead and move over to the 10x lens by pushing it over the slide until it clicks in place. As you notice, the field of view and the specimen are more narrow. You can use the coarse adjustment knob, but that's a big increase. So the fine adjustment knob will do just fine in this case. Now we have it pretty much in view, and you can move to the 40x objective lens if you'd like to get a closer look, which would probably be beneficial with this specific slide. Make sure only to use the fine adjustment, making very small adjustments with this specific 40x lens. You see very little adjustments make a huge difference. Okay, we have a pretty good picture there. Now, if we want to move to the 100x objective lens, we'll have to use the immersion oil. Be sure not to use the 100x without the oil because it could damage the lens. In order to put on the oil, it can be a little tricky, so we're going to show you how to do that after we show you inside the microscope view of the oil immersion lens. So right now I'm just dropping a little bit of oil on the slide, which we'll demonstrate here in a minute. Once the oil is on the slide, we can go ahead and move on the 100x objective lens. Now for this microscope, the oil immersion lens at 100x is the most magnified image that you're going to get. Be sure only to use the fine adjustment with this one. And this one can be a bit tricky to get into focus. And there we go.
and try not to move around the stage with the oil immersion lens too much because you want to keep the lens over the oil. Very slight movements will suffice. Now, for the oil immersion lens, you must use oil. Be sure not to get that oil on any of the other objective lenses because it could damage them. If you happen to do so on accident, be sure to notify your instructor so they can clean the lenses as soon as possible. Now, as you can see, we had the 40X and the 100X lenses separated over top of the slide. That is so we don't get the oil on the lenses. Feel free to add the oil right onto the slide where you'll be looking. Once you have the oil in place, move the 100X over the slide and you, as you can see it dips right in the oil which will give us a nice view. Once you're finished with the immersion lens, be sure to move it to the side. You can go ahead and move down the stage as well. And just wipe it off. And be sure not to get that oil on the other lenses as we talked about earlier.